Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Recreating. Today we're going to be reviewing the new Ultimate Gremlin by NECA. Stay tuned. Hey guys, so I wanted to do a quick review of the NECA uh, Ultimate Gremlin. Uh, it just came out. Um, I just got it at Target. And I wanted to make a quick review of it. Um, I'm a big Gremlins fan. I've always been a big Gremlins fan. If you ask my wife, she's tired of me buying these things. <laughs> but uh, she's very supportive and very loving. And I know she loves me because she supports this stuff. So, um, anyway, uh, enough of that emotional stuff. Uh, so, this is a new Ultimate Gremlin. Uh, let's take a look at the cover. Cute, clever, mischievous, intelligent, and dangerous. And at the bottom is the Gremlins, Ultimate Gremlins, and then there's the cover of the actual movie, and then Gremlins on top, NECA, Real Toys, H14 and up, Warning, Choking Hazard, side just has Gremlins, Ultimate Gremlin, at the bottom, all that good stuff. Uh, this side's the same thing as the other side, and the back has the cover of has uh, the thesis of the movie or the sell point of the movie or the story of the movie this is the way they have it in the back of the actual uh, DVD and then um, Gremlins there and I sorry I just had to put my phone on the side of it. Um, and then it has the different ways you could display your Gremlin uh, the Coke and the popcorn, which is most likely the way I'm going to display this guy. The 3D glasses and the Coke, the cards, the cigarette. It's too bad they don't have the visor, because in the original movie, you guys see it has a visor on it. Um, this one, they didn't include the visor. You could just have it with the popcorn or just with the candy. Whatever way you want to display it, you're free to do so. Um, I'm going to let you guys read that. If you guys want to read that, feel free to do so. You guys can pause it if you want. One thing I did notice, guys, is the tape. Uh, the camera doesn't really pick it up, but it's kind of yellowish. Um, I don't know if NECA did that on purpose or not, but this tape is actually yellow. Um, well, it looks yellow to me. I don't know if you guys could see that or not. The camera doesn't really pick it up, but in person it looks yellow, which is pretty cool if NECA actually did that on purpose because um, all the old toys uh, the tape used to yellow. It, it used to get yellow and you could see it uh, on all the old school toys when you used to uh, collect all the old school toys. Uh, very nostalgic, so it's pretty awesome. A uh, little touch if they did, did that. If not, it's just yellow tape. <laughs> but anyways, um, so this is the inside of it. Uh, there you go, you can see all the goodies. On this side, it has a picture of the Gremlin itself with some little smog, little effect little nice little photo up the gremlin and there's the gremlin itself okay sorry about that my little daughter was calling me um, so anyways let's open this this guy up let's see what we got inside looks inside um there's one thing I was noticing on this thing was the paint job. I'm a little, let, let's open it and I will talk about it. So anyways, it's got the board in the back for a little effect in case you guys want to take a picture of it in the background. Um, let's put these little things out. There's the cola. Nice little ice cubes in there. Looks pretty cool. And then we got the beer. Beer on tab. Tab. Whatever you call it. And sunglasses. And popcorn bag. There's the popcorn bags. Um, open this. I'll open this later. Skittles, but they call it a. Uh, they don't want to get um, uh, sued, so they call it Brad Bites. Bite sites candy. Uh, 
Musketeers bar, but they call it Dudan bar. Nice little detail on that. Playing cards. Which is pretty nice that they're all stuck together so you won't lose them. Uh, but they feel really good. Uh, the back feels like paper. Uh, the front looks just plastic. Which is pretty nice. little cigarette it looks like it's been it focuses on it <laughs> I don't think it's gonna focus on it it's too small there you go looks like it's been smoked on the one side filter on the other side and let's get this guy out it's got a bunch of straps let's get the straps handy dandy blade here One more there, and should be able to get him out. There we go. Articulation, it's pretty nice. Well, not that great. <laughs> uh, at first, and of course, all the joints are going to be pretty hard to move at first. It's going to get some used to uh, moving. Uh, but as far as the shoulder goes, that's that's how it goes. It doesn't. Oh, there you go. Never mind. Goes all the way up like that. Little uh, wrist swivel. There's no ball joint there, so it can't. It doesn't go back and forth. It just rotates like that. Uh, fingers do not move. It just stays like that. I guess so you could grab the coke or whatever it is. Just pretty weird. Um, hmm. uh, little ball joint at the at the stomach or the midsection. Uh, ball joints at the there and there. Like I said, it's a lot of it's kind of hard. Uh, ball joints there, like the original ones that came out. And what about this? I guess I can move it back. Hmm. Oh, can you move it back? I feel like I'm gonna break it if I move it back. I don't know. It doesn't really move that well. Just a little tail. Back around face. One thing I did notice, guys, that I wanted to bring up earlier, but um, the jaw. If you guys could see, the jaw's crooked. It looks like he, somebody just socked him in the jaw and broke his jaw. You guys see it? Can you close the jaw? See how it looks crooked like that? It looks like he has a smirk. I don't know if that's intentional or. Not supposed to look like that. I don't know, but it looked. From, there was three. There's three of them at the store, and uh, um, all three had the same thing. So I'm assuming they're supposed to be like that. Um, as far as the ears go, the ears bent back, which is really nice. That looks really cool. That's probably how I'm gonna display this guy. I love that. That's one of the nice little touches that they put in it. Um, the eyeballs look really cool. They're actual like eyeball eyeballs looking. It's not just uh, a cover over it or something. It's an eyeball inside the little um, little socket there, which is pretty nice touch. Uh, there's the top of it. The back, you can see the neck. It rotates, which is pretty cool. Oh, that's really nice articulation on the head and the neck it's really really good I love that um, the arms like I said go all the way up but sometimes it gets stuck paint job let's talk about the paint job 
I'm not too fond of the paint job. Even though it's pretty easy, simple paint, I I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Maybe it'll grow on me. But this looks kind of like sloppy to me. Uh, I don't know. If it's just me, but I really like this. This looks really cool. The ears, the head. I'm pleased with the head part. The chest part's okay, but as you could tell, it looks kind of. I don't know. I don't know, it doesn't look like it's, I don't know if it's meant to look like that. I don't know. That, that it kind of throws me off a little bit. It throws me off a little bit. Uh, as far as the feet, uh, they always had little ones. If you compare it to the um, part two, uh, the feet are a lot bigger, but these are pretty cool looking. And, um, yeah, that's, basically it see how he stands does it give me trouble standing yep he's gonna give me some trouble standing that's another problem there you go all right so let's give him a beer that's that's the thing that hinders him from drinking the beer like he has to literally move his arm all the way to the side in order to put the beer in the smell the beer doesn't even go in his arm <laughs> um, he can't hold any drinks on this hand because this hand is made for like the cards so in somehow Gonna be the same thing. Like I said, it's kind of like hard to like position him to drink the coke. You know what I mean, I don't know. I don't know. You can put a chocolate bar here. You can put a cigarette there. Oh, that's probably why they made his mouth that way, so they could put the cigarette in there. Hmm, that makes a lot of sense now. Uh, there you go. That's so one thing I want to do is the popcorn stuff. So let's get the popcorn open. These are just little bags, little paper bags. This is pretty cool. Uh, let's get these open. Because you have to fold them up yourself. Make sure you fold them up right. There's no bottom to it, which is kind of disappointing in a way. I guess you could just print these out yourself. <laughs> uh, put these in his ears. Like so. I guess you could just print a copy of these out yourself. Nika, if you're watching this, you should be able to and a picture of these out yourself. You guys should have a link. Then this is stuck. You guys can see it's glued on together. I can't pull it apart because it'll rip. It sucks, but <laughs> there you go. The 3D glasses are pretty cool. Nice little 3D glasses. Part. Here with my knife. So I'll bend this again. Turn his ears like that. There you go. Ultimate grandma. Overall, pretty nice. I like it. I've been waiting for this sucker for a long, long time. Um, glad I got it. 
but there is a few little things like I said the paint job isn't all that great uh, the articulation isn't all that great uh, him standing up isn't all that great <laughs> you have to like really really force him to stand up or put him against something a cigarette keeps coming out of his mouth like that yeah, there you go there you have it ultimate grimman guys um let's say uh i'll give it an eight out of ten um ten eight out of ten um stars or whatever you want to call it uh, it's cool i like it i've been waiting for it for a long time maybe it's just me that i've been waiting for it for a long time that i really really like it but uh, that's what gives it the 8 rating, but there's a lot of things that hinder the movements. Uh, it doesn't really stand up on its own. Um, the popcorn thing doesn't really have a, a <laughs> the bottom part to it. It's just not a big deal, but I mean, you could always print these out and make your own popcorn bags or make your own little things with it, which I'm going to do, so stay tuned for that. I'm going to do... I got three of these guys to for that purpose that I'm going to make my own little gremlin things to it, my own little, um, um, little accessories, if you will, and um, yeah, stay tuned for that. If you guys want to watch that, make sure you guys subscribe, make sure you guys hit the bell notification, uh, make sure you guys... Um, uh, leave me a uh, comment down below. What do you guys think of this thing? Are you guys gonna pick this up? Uh, oh, by the way, it's $27 for this one. 27 bucks for this guy. Um, that's a lot of money and NECA toys are going higher and higher all the time. The money's getting ridiculous with these NECA toys. Um, it's just it's getting ridiculous. Um, 20 bucks was really cool. I would love to pay 20 bucks for this thing. It's worth the $20. $27 is asking a lot <laughs> especially from a poor man uh is i don't know oh that's what gives it the eight rating i guess it's just that's what dropped it down and even one point the, the price point for this thing but um other than that um it's cool anyways thank you guys for watching please subscribe hit the bell notification if you guys do guess what you guys will see me on the next one peace